if I'm not yet 100% there emotionally, um, is it okay for me to begin to explore what adoption would look like as uh, my pathway forward in my family building journey? Yeah, I think that's probably the best time yeah. <laughs> to start exploring mm -hmm. because you might be mentally trying to get yourself 100% ready. And if you're not exploring and looking at what does this really look like, mm -hmm. you might be sort of preparing yourself with misconceptions about adoption and, and not actually facts about adoption and experiences about adoption. And so if you're sort of, oh, I'm going to keep doing, you know, fertility treatments or exploring this and, mm -hmm. you know, adoption is maybe the next step for me after that, mm -hmm. it's okay to kind of have one foot in both camps while you're on the you know, in the exploration phase. I would say it's it's probably not the time to start applying and things like that, but researching, you know, what does adoption look like in 2024? What agencies are out there? You know, would I do an independent route? Things like that to try to really get, you know, do your information gathering stage uh, because it also may help you decide one way or the other, is this for me or is this this not for me?